Colin Cardry, the century maker in the first innings. Now coming in to see if he can perhaps increase the tempo a little bit. I was so weary. I thought it was a pretty tall order. And it did hinge on the start, really. And others were saying, come on, you know, I think the others were saying, we'll have a little doubt. If we have a chance, we'll get these. You know, Tom Graveney was particularly bullish. In fairness, the, the others were more, more optimistic than I was. But once we got a start, then it did start to look different. And fortunately, I played well at a vital point. Gives to boycott on 49. That's his 50. Sobers fielding by the square leg umpire. 80 runs needed as Cowdery faces Gibbs. And he's hit that hard and high, and it's going down the long arm boundary. And it's four runs, well clear of all the fielders. England score 140 for one, chasing a target of 215, which means they need 75 in 55 minutes. Sobers comes in, bows to Cowdery, and he's played that one down to fine leg, and it's four more runs. Four more runs to Cowdery. Sobers in, bows to Cowdery, and he's hit that through, and it's four runs. So England now need 47 runs for victory. Gibbs comes in, bows to Cowdery, and he's hit that high, and he's going to be out. That's the end of Colin Cowdery's magnificent innings. Caught Sobers, bowled Gibbs for 71. Gibbs comes in, bows to Boycott, and he's hit that high, and he's gone for four runs. 19 now for victory. Gibbs comes in, bows to Boycott, and he's cut that one down, it's four more runs. Nine runs for victory. In over even time, Gibbs comes in, bows to Dolabero, and he's inside edge, and he's gone down to fine leg, and they're going to take two runs. Three runs needed now for victory. And it could well be that this is the last over of the day, of the match. And he's hit that to mid-wicket. They've taken one, and they're taking another one. Two runs. Gibbs comes in, bows to Dolavera, and he's played around the corner, and they're taking it. England have won. England have won a memorable victory with probably two balls to go.